Hey guys, Waterfaller41 here, and in today's video, instead of installing any sort of truck part, we're basically talking through why I went with the Corsa Extreme system. So if you've been following either my channel, my Instagram, or uh, Steve Fess over at Hammerdown Motorsports, you know that he posted a video a couple days ago. He took a couple of the uh, video clips of my uh, Corsa Extreme system, and he basically edited them together with his Borla attack system as sort of a side-by-side -side of which exhaust you like better. Do you like the Borla system or the Corsa system? So he provided some input as to why he liked the Borla system over the Corsa system, so I figure it's only right for me to provide some input as to why I like the Corsa Extreme system over the Borla system. Hence the reason I have the Corsa Stream system on my truck. So first off, um, these two exhaust systems are arguably two of the best exhaust systems out there for our trucks. There's a bunch of other exhaust systems out there, but Corsa and Borla are, are basically top dogs when it comes to exhaust systems. So you really can't go wrong with either system. Um, they have awesome warranties, they're T304, they're gonna probably outlast the truck itself. Um, but as far as the differences, so exhaust sound. So the Borla system, and you'll see that in a few minutes, the Borla system is a little bit lower of an exhaust note. It's really kind of a muscular truck sound, whereas the Corsa system, it's a little bit more of a sport car sound. So it's raspy, it's, uh, it's a little bit higher pitch as far as the exhaust tone, but to me, it sounds like a sport. It's a race car, it's an awesome sound and exhaust system. And I've always wanted a Corsa system, so I use this truck as an opportunity to pick up said exhaust system. Um, so outside of the exhaust note, uh, the other differences in terms of the two exhaust systems is the, the style of exhaust tips. And this is where I think Borla really dropped the ball. So Borla is a top tier exhaust system. I would have anticipated a little bit better of an exhaust system than a single walled rear rolled tip angle cut. So basically if you look at the Borla exhaust system, you're going to see it's a single wall tip. Whereas on the Corsa systems, like a lot of the other top tier exhaust systems, uses a double walled system, which I think personally looks a lot better. It gives it a well refined, more of a finished look versus the rolled tip. The rolled tip, again, it's it's rolled tips have been around for ages. They look okay and you can get them in black and they look pretty good, but they look just like the factory tips and that's kind of boring to me. Whereas the double wall tips definitely give it a nice refined finish. So anyway, uh, what I did is I took some of Steve's clips and I added them next to mine. So you guys could get a feel for what the Corsa system sounds like next to the Borla system. So we do some slow starts, we do some driving around, we do some hard acceleration and some cold start revving. So let me know what you think down in the description below. Do you think the Corsa system is what you like or are you more of the Borla fan? And, and like I said, you can't go wrong with either system. They are awesome exhaust systems. It's really down to the tips and the tone. What do you like better? Do you like the lower, more muscular truck sound or do you like the higher, more sport car sound of the Corsa system? Or do you like the rolled single wall tips on the Borla or do you like the dual wall tips on the Corsa? So I already let my kids uh, watch some of the exhaust sound clips and I let them kind of figure out who they like better. I didn't tell them whose truck was who uh, until the end. So what do you think? Who do you like better? Uh, my dad's truck. Why do you like it? Uh, because like the exhaust pipe is a little louder and yeah. You heard it folks, the exhaust pipe is louder on my truck and really I don't know what it, if it is. The Borla attack system is actually about as loud as the Corsa Extreme system. I don't have decibel readings like I do in my Corsa video, but I'd be willing to bet that the Corsa and Borla system are about as loud as each other. What about you? What do you think? Daddy's. Daddy's? Why? Because it has a louder sound <laughs> and, it, and it goes faster. It goes faster than Mr. Hammerdown's? My truck is faster than Mr. Hammerdown's apparently. But anyway, let me know what you think. Uh, like I said, I got some Borla attack sound clips. I got some Corsa Extreme, arguably two of the best exhaust systems. Let me know down in the description below. Do you like my Corsa Extreme? Do you like Hammerdown's uh, Borla attack system? And definitely, if you're not already a subscriber of his channel, definitely head over there. I'll leave a link to his channel in the description below. But while you're listening to these exhaust sound clips, I'm gonna go ahead and stop these guys from beating the crap out of each other with hockey sticks and snow. 
All right, so I had mentioned that the Corsa system has a double walled exhaust or exhaust tip, so I wanted to show you what those look like. That is them. So they come in a brushed, so like a silver finish. They come in a black, and then like mine in the PVD. My truck is super dirty right now, mostly because my rear window is still leaking. I can't get it clean, but I wanted to show you what the dual wall looks like. And basically, it's a wall on the outside and then an internal wall. And like I said, it gives it a much cleaner, more finished look versus the rolled tips of the Borlay system. But anyway. Let's take a look at those sound clips. <laughs> 